Good morning, everyone. The mortgage industry is a buzz with some recent news that OSFI is going to be proposing some changes to the current mortgage stress test and the impacts this is going to have on the Canadian lending and real estate landscape. Well, I'd love to answer some questions and concerns about this in the next couple minutes or so. So let me jump right in. So number one, the proposed rule changes are impacting what's called uninsured mortgage borrowers. And they're talking about increasing the potential stress test or qualifying rate associated to these. So who makes up the uninsured borrowers? Well, three main areas. Number one, Canadians that are looking to refinance their current mortgage. Number two, Canadians looking to purchase an investment property. And number three, those that are purchasing above a million dollars or require a 30-year amortization. Now, starting with refinances, you know, the impact of this is about 5% of how much you would have qualified for pre this proposed rule change. That means that if you're accessing equity in your home, you'll be able to access slightly less. That's a good thing because we don't want to be taking all of the money out of our current properties um, and using it to consolidate debt or, you know, to make purchases and things of that nature. Investment properties, again, pretty good news, you know, we want people that are purchasing investment properties to be well qualified, to be able to um, ensure a little bit of stability in this purchase and in this asset. And finally, those that are purchasing over a million and uh, require a 30 year amortization or beyond, not a bad thing, right? Because when we're purchasing those high value properties, we want to make sure that we can qualify for, for it, not just today, but in the years ahead. So the impacts of this, you know, not necessarily negative or adverse. The one thing that probably will come from this is a mindset change. So it won't have a, a, a functional impact on cooling down the Canadian real estate market, but it may have a psychological change in the impact that it has. You know, every time there's a rule change that's announced, we often see a spur towards the market. That might be a possibility, but we also see a mindset change in Canadians and how they adopt and how they look at or perceive the current environment and the landscape. So that certainly might have a slight impact on what's going on in the currently lava hot real estate market. But I hope that answers some of the questions on this proposed rule change and how it impacts you. If you have any additional questions, please contact the CLC Network Mortgage Agent. They're the best at the job. If you want to find out more, call U Group at 647-4800.